Welcome back to my morning report analysis videos on Wednesday, 18th of July, with me, which is market analyst at Hantec Markets. Let's have a look at dollar yen breaking out. Um, it looked yesterday as though initially, so the market was sort of looking a little bit more as though it's on a corrective drift. Uh, and I was saying yesterday, sort of ideal buying opportunity would be around 11.40. Um, you're not looking like you're going to get that now um, after Jerome Powell's congressional testimony. Certainly seemed to put the dollar bulls back on track. That's now left support at 12.20 as a higher low and broken out above sort of all the resistance uh, to levels not seen since January. So you're looking at 12.35 and then up towards 12... Seven, uh, sorry, thir sorry 13.35 up towards 13.75. Um, so yeah, we're really looking at um, continued moves to the upside um, and buying into weakness. Look at the strength of the momentum indicator, RSI, 74, 75 area, rising on MACD lines, solidly strong on stochastics. So yeah, you are still very much in control in the bull's corner. Um, hourly chart looks strongly configured as well, although there's a slight sort of, okay, I suppose you could argue, rolling element to the MACD lines, perhaps stochastics, perhaps RSI. Perhaps you could get a little retreat um, back from 13 figure, and you're looking at 1280 as that sort of breakout area. But to be honest, anything that sort of finds support between 1220, which was yesterday's low, and 12 and 1280, I think you're looking fairly confident still that you're going to get further gains, because I think the outlook on the uh, daily chart looks very strong still or certainly does now, so following on from that bull candle that sort of reinvigorated the bulls. So I wish you good luck in your trading today and I'll speak to you later.